at 31 years of age making his first start since uh, a good two weeks. The strike two pitch is swung on and missed and down goes EY. He makes a sweeping gesture towards the team as Fowler strikes out on the 2 2 pitch coming up. And that is taken for strike three call. Veteran, how about this? For the 10th straight year, he is going to the playoffs, and he never played for the Yankees. 31 runs batted in. Marquis comes back, and the pitch is pulled inside first down the line by the diving Jombie. Goes all the way into the corner, and Pierre is letting out. He is on his way for three and makes it easily. Out of a stretch goes Marquis, and his 1 2 pitch is inside. Foul tip caught by the catcher, and Hudson doesn't think he fouled it, but he's been called out by Brian Gorman. Of course, he'd love to finish up the year hitting 300, and he's turned around. Fastball at the ribs. One ball and no strikes. Jason Marquis is trying to win his 16th. In fact, they are now awarding Kent first base. So that pitch apparently got his shirt and the three two pitch will watch Kemp. He is going. It is off the plate for ball four and the Dodgers have the bases loaded with one out. When the Dodgers had a really good home club that won 54. Two one pitch is a line drive base hit in the right field down in the corner. In comes Pierre. In comes Kemp. Stopping at third is easier on a long single by Casey Blake, and the Dodgers lead two to nothing. So the Dodgers who came up with five in the seventh inning last night, not waiting today, and immediately put two on the board here in the first. A lot of clouds, 69 degrees. The 1 0 pitch is hit into right center. That's going to go for a base hit. In comes Ethier. Blake will go to third, and the Dodgers lead three to nothing in the first inning. So Minkiewicz, a single into right center field, listed at 197. The one-two pitch coming up, and who lunges at a pitch down and away and strikes out? Because in those days you won the pennant. It was really a big deal. That's a drive into center for a base hit. So Ellis. Will pick up a run batted in as he picks up Casey Blake. So my one moment as a manager in the big leagues. Runners go 3 2 pitch swung on and missed. Got the story in just in time. He's also had as many as 137 runs batted in. He looks at strike three call. Good pitch outside corner. Goes behind the plate back to back games. Chris looks at strike three call. How about that? Here's the one two pitch and hop swings and it's a high drive to center and deep back goes Kemp to the track wall gone home run for Brad hop and that shatters the string of strikeouts and it gets the Colorado Rockies on the board and the Dodgers lead four to one for Brad hop who is usually a pain in the neck against the Dodgers his 23rd home run. Is 86 run batted in when they won 95. That's another story. The 3 0 pitch is swung on and hit to right, coming up and having to play it on a bounce is Ethier hitting just 167. He slices a flare down the left field line. Blake backhands it going away. And the first pitch, he slaps a bunt wide at third. He charges and he's out at first. A wonderful play by Ian Stewart. Boy, that was a great bunt. It wasn't just up the line, it was way to the left of the third baseman. Stewart actually went and skidded on his knees on the grass. And you leave your feet against the air, it takes a magician to get the out. And while on his right knee, you get the feeling that Garrett Atkins knows he's not going to be with the Rockies next year. And meanwhile, Hudson slaps one to the gap. That'll go to the wall, and Orlando will stop at second base. Of the five, and one of them was Marquis. Ground ball to short. Kinsania takes care of it. Demolishes another during the year, and then it doesn't pay off in the World Series or playoff. 
Long fly ball picked off by Fowler, and that'll end the inning for the National League. He was hitting 342 when the game began. Marquis swings, doesn't get it. Ellis picks it up and throws down to Minkavich for the out. He began the day with 141. Runs batted in. A one hopper, bad hop, great pick by Hudson to throw him out. You talk about major league reflexes. That the 3 2 pitch on the way is swung on and a great shot down the right field line by the diving Minkavich. Into second base goes Fowler and he keeps on going and he'll wind up standing with a triple. One two pitch on the way and he swings and misses. So Padilla puts him away. But remember Brad Osmus is the manager. Ground ball to short up with it there easily is Quintanilla to get him. Which of course is a a, a great tribute to the fans in Southern California. Minkavich a single to right center as Fowler gets it back in to keep it jewel light as who hard ground ball to short they're going to get one EY is going to turn it and that'll be the double play one two pitch to Giambi down he goes so he strikes out a second time wow that's a strike. So Ionetta strikes out a second time. Another change, and that's promptly whacked into right field. Go so over to get it is Ethier. So off speed pitches. That was a curveball at about 80. And Hop straightens it out. There goes the runner, and it's popped in the air back a third down the line. Coming over is Hu, and Chin Lung makes the catch. A little roll at a shortstop. The charge by Quintanilla to get him. Favor of the Dodgers. They send nine men to the plate in the first inning to score four. There's a line drive base hit for Padilla. And ground ball to the hole by the diving young. Stopping at second is Padilla. And the Dodgers have runners at first and second and one. Pierre's two for three. And Hudson walks, so Repco will have a shot with runners at first and third. And Carpenter has won 17. Ground ball, nice play by Giambi to smother it and then take it to the bag, and that's the end. So a 34 mile an hour difference back to back. Breaking ball, line drive, speared by Minkavich. Doug Minkavich making a wonderful play. Otherwise, that's down the line for extra bases. And we have one away and Mike McCoy coming up. He's on a major league roster. He's 28 years old. And he's on a major league roster for the first time in his career. A chopper up the middle. Hudson gets rid of it in a hurry to take care of Mike. With 16 times. Well, that was good as Young strikes out a second time. Ten strikeouts for Vicente Padilla in low class A. So he's a classic late developer. Ground ball hits the rubber, bounces in the air. Quintanilla double clutches and drops the ball. So I would assume that a fly ball to left field, it's playable. Seth Smith is there. So Minkavich a fly ball, two down, 2 0 pitch on the way, and that's going to be hit in the right field by the diving young. So Chin Lung Hu gets a base hit. He goes one for three. Dodgers at first and second. And then four years ago, he broke his arm playing basketball. Chopper to short. They go quickly to Young, and they get the force play on Hu. Juan Castro. Meanwhile, Dexter Fowler strikes out. Oh, there they go again. Seth Smith strikes out. High fly ball, right center. Ethier hesitated a split second, but now it comes over, and that's that. So on this Sunday visit, we play five and a half innings, and the Dodgers lead four to one. And that's lifted to left center, playable. Smith is there calling. So Loney, fly ball to left field, one out, single to right. This time pops it up, 
angling out is Quintanilla waving his left fielder away but Smith didn't see it signed by the Dodgers way back in 1991 and his glove has kept him in the big leagues for so many years since he first came up in 95 hitting 228 and that got the bat no it got his hand mm. so Ionetta hit by the pitch and is awarded first base favor the Dodgers they got all four in the first inning and that's on the corner Merton can't believe it well now there you go Stewart strikes out two strikeouts so far for Moda well <laughs> not laughing just amazed and that got Repco on the hand and there goes Repco Phillips throw an attempted tag by Pentania and he is unable to hold on to it here's the attempted tag and then that left hand is spun around as the ball went on back and that's low and inside ball four tries to bunt they throw back and got him so Repco is nailed like Padilla earlier and for Repco trying to cheat and Repco is hung out to dry as Kintani is right there to nail him two six and that's a fly ball to right field going back is Merton and makes the catch. So one minute two on and nobody out. Ground ball into right field off the glove of Young who made a great effort to go way out into the outfield. So Minkiewicz comes up with his third hit. Sandy Amaros making an incredible catch in the left field corner. And there's a drive to right center and that's going to go to the wall. So the Dodgers finally get on the board in the inning. As Ephia scores, Minkava stops at third on the long double. Check swing, and it's going to be strike three, and that'll do it for Ellis. The Dodgers managed to get one. Is still in there. That's a pop fly. Minkava in foul ground. One away. And then add two more to make it 27. But at least Young with two strikes. And whacks it into center. Though so a two out single for Fowler. And he goes two for four. Brad Hopp was two for two. Breaking ball. Slapped the left center Pierre on his horse. And he can't get it against the wall. So here comes Fowler around third he will score easily on a long double by Seth Smith. So after striking out three times Smitty drives in Fowler. And that takes care of that. Yambi strikes out a third time. Off speed and hitting the right field for a base hit. So a two ball two strike change up and let's put it this way that's a pitch certainly that Jim Tomey can catch up to. Ground ball up the middle smothered by EY they get the force wonderful play. 14 Juan Castro. And a drive into left center and deep Fowler makes the catch. Boy, Daddy Longlegs, he can really do it. He can go and get him with the best of them. And he really had to go to take an extra base hit away. There goes Pierre. The pitch is low. The throw is even lower. And so Pierre steals his 30th base. And down goes Repco. And the Dodgers leave Pierre. And at the end of eight. Inside for ball four to the Phils this year. That's going to be a base hit. A little shattered bat, and just like that, two on and nobody out on a walk and a single. And Ian Stewart coming up. 
Fastball got him. Fastball chopper off the glove picked up and tripped up is who the throw is late and the bases are loaded. How about that play. Little roller down towards who he has to go to first high but a toe dance by Minkiewicz scoring his spillboards. And he hits one to Minkiewicz and that's it. So Brad Osmus getting handshakes in the dugout. Congratulations, Skipper. You've won your first. The regulars came out with the exception of Juan Pierre. They would have taken him out, but they ran out of people. They had to wind up with Juan Castro playing left field.